Designing a title slide in PowerPoint can be really challenging and also boring. But in this video, I'm going to show you how it can be super easy to design a title slide in PowerPoint. I'll show you how you can do that in under five minutes. Sounds amazing, right? So let's get started. So here's how your typical title slide looks like. It has some text, maybe even some images, but it looks boring, right? So let's change that. Let's start by adding a new blank slide and let's delete this first slide. Now I'm gonna copy and paste the image that I've already downloaded. So I'm just gonna to go to the folder, copy this image and paste it onto the PowerPoint presentation using Control V. And I'm just gonna adjust the image and resize it to fit the image to the slide. Now let's duplicate the image. I'm gonna right click and press copy and also press Control V or paste the image. Now what we're gonna do is remove the background of this second image. So for that, I'm gonna click on the picture format option and I'm gonna to go to remove background and I'm gonna click that. And as soon as you do that, you'll see that the image background has been removed. Now at this point, it is worth mentioning that if you're not able to remove the background perfectly from your image, there are a few tools which are available on the internet for free, mostly, which you can use to remove the image background. For instance, you can use this tool remove.bg or you can use Canva, which is a paid tool by the way, but you can also use Adobe Firefly, which offers this service for free. I'll leave a link to all these tools in the description below. So once you've removed the background of the image, we're gonna click on the base image and change the color saturation by going to the picture format and clicking on color and changing the saturation to 0%. Next, we're gonna select the image and change the transparency of the image to 80%. All right, that's amazing. Now we're gonna select the top image and overlap the two images such that they look like so. Now let's select both the images together and expand the images such that it fits the slide like this. And now we're gonna select each of these images individually and crop these images. So let's click on picture format and the crop tool. And now we'll crop this image, the top image first to fit the slide. Next, we're gonna select the bottom image, click on crop once again, and crop it to fit the slide. Awesome, now let's add some text to the slide. So we're gonna click on insert and add a text box, and we'll add a text box over here. And here we're gonna add the text. So I'm gonna add the first name for Lionel Messi. And here I'm gonna choose the bold font. Any bold font will do. I'm gonna go with Montserrat, and I'm gonna go with a black version. Let's increase the font size to about 239 points and adjust the text box to fit the text perfectly on the slide. Now let's move the text box around to perfectly align the text box. Now let's change the color of this text to white and right click on this and send to back. We'll send it backwards. Now let's duplicate this text box by copy and pasting it or you can even press Command D to duplicate the text box. Move it towards the bottom of the image and add the text. Here I'm gonna add the second name, which is Messi. And now we're gonna change the color of this text. And I'm gonna use the eyedropper tool to choose a color. Click on the eyedropper tool and select one of the colors from the images. And once you're satisfied, click OK. Perfect, so now we have the design of the slide already ready with us. So the next thing that we need to do over here is add the slide transition so that it looks beautiful, it looks amazing. So here, what we're gonna do is first duplicate the slide. So I wanna right click on the first slide and select duplicate. Now we're gonna go to the first slide and zoom out as much as possible. Choose the top image and make sure that you expand the image out of the slide so that it doesn't fit on the slide. It's not visible on the slide. And we'll also move the text, the top and the bottom text in opposite directions. And you're gonna understand that in a moment very quickly. Let's also change the saturation of this color to rather the transparency of this color to about 90%. Yeah, 90% looks fine for me. Awesome. Let's close this. Now let's select both the slides. Let's add the transition. We're going to click on transition and add the morph transition. Let's also change the duration of the transition to about one second. Awesome. And we have the slide which is completely ready. So let's take a look at how it looks. Beautiful, beautiful. So now that you've learned how to create this slide design in PowerPoint, check out this other video where I teach you step by step on how to create a beautiful team slide in PowerPoint. And if you've enjoyed watching this video, make sure that you hit the like button and subscribe to this channel and I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye.